Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve if files and folders have suddenly disappeared on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So perhaps you're just browsing around and maybe some of your files accidentally have been deleted or are missing. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to hopefully resolve it without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump straight into it. First thing I recommend doing would be to take a look in the recycling bin and you can sort in the columns by the name of the file as well as date deleted and the size as well as the date modified. And you're welcome to go ahead and actually search the recycling bin as well and you can restore files just by right clicking on it and then restoring it. So pretty straightforward on that. That's the first thing I'd recommend taking a look into. Something else, if you're looking underneath perhaps Windows or File Explorer and you're noticing files or folders aren't visible, you may want to consider opening up File Explorer and then selecting the three dotted icon up at the top right to see more and then selecting options. Select the view tab and underneath hidden files and folders select show hidden files folders and drives and select apply and OK. And you may see hidden folders or files that weren't visible now apparently are. So that's something else I recommend taking a look at. Something further we can check into would be opening up the search menu, type in security. Best match if you're using Microsoft's Windows Security as your antivirus, you may want to go ahead and open that up here. And if you're using another third-party antivirus, I'd recommend checking that one as well. And you want to open up the quarantine section, so every antivirus is going to be a little different here. So I'm going to go underneath Fires and Threat Protection. And then if you go down underneath Fires and Threat Protections and select Manage Settings, if underneath current threats, if you select protection history, you should see a list of items in here. If there were anything in the quarantine, you could select the icon next to the message. And underneath actions, you could remove or empty from the quarantine from there. So that's certainly a possibility as well. So just wanted to cover a few different possible workarounds or solutions for you. And hopefully I was able to help resolve your problem. And as always, thank you for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.